So you asked me what I've learned, what's important, what matters on this anniversary. And I just got off the phone with Winston. He has this opportunity to go away for two weeks. He's like, you know, but I had to check with you to see if it would if it would work. And immediately I was like, of course, of course you should go, even if he can't be here for, you know, heart surgery. And I realized that what what has changed is the way that I trust people and the way that I trust people to be there for me. I don't look anymore over performative signs of support and presence. And I used to really do that. I used to be much more transactional about it. I think partially because of my own insecurity about stuff and also partially because I just didn't really know how to trust, how to trust so deeply that others care. I've learned that I don't have to do this stuff alone. And there have been so many times where I'm going through this and I'm like, I am so, I'm so alone and I'm not. I've learned that I need a lot of attention I really do. <laughs> I need so much attention. What I've learned is that that's okay. That it's okay to be me and get through this the way that I'm getting through it, which is to just constantly diversify and be extroverted. And when I first got sick, I was like, why am I talking about this all the time? Like, I wish that I could be more quiet and subtle and stoic and not be like, oh my God, you guys, look at me. But I realized, like, that's that's who I am. And I don't get to decide not to be like that. I've learned that I don't get to decide a lot of things. I don't get to choose my struggles. And I've learned what letting go feels like. I don't know, I've learned what it's like not to have a choice about something and to just have to do it. And I say this every time, but I've, I've learned that I am loved and I've learned that I can love other people deeply. I don't know. That's kind of what I'm thinking about. And I'm really, really tired today. I'm still tired. And I've learned that it's okay to be tired. I never used to think it was okay to take a break. That's it for now. Thanks for asking.